Do you want your aim and movement to look like this? Oh my god, shit! I'm moving different. If the answer is yes, I created this movement guide to help you out with that. What's good YouTube, it's Yukota, and in this video I'm giving you guys a movement guide on how to move like a pro and just really have good movement in MW3. So I'm going to be covering all of the movement tricks in here from slide canceling, um, tag reset, good controller settings, good aim and all that. So make sure y'all stay tuned until the end of the video. Um, leave a like, if you're new, comment. And uh, and hit the hit the hit the sub button. You know what I'm saying. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video. Let's get straight into it. First thing I'm gonna be teaching you guys is obviously how to slide cancel. I know this is a very big um, like part of the movement or whatever in Call of Duty. I know everyone probably knows like how to slide cancel, but of course I'm gonna I'm gonna show you guys. So in MW3, if you guys don't know, you don't have to slide slide jump. I mean, you you can still do it, but you know you can just make it really easy on yourself. Just just slide jump. All right, so you run slide jump run slide jump and that's how you, that's how you slide cancel and um in this shit run slide jump and the reason why slide canceling is so important in this moving guide is obviously yeah, it'll make your clips look really good as well, but it's really good for um, reach island. So if there's somebody that's like right here, you know, you'll be obviously on this side, you'll be coming down. There's a person right over that wall. You just, you know, hit them with a slide cancel. It's really, it's really just like unexpected, to be honest. From their, from their point of view, it'll just be you like, um, just popping up out of nowhere. I like, literally just popping up out of nowhere. You know what I'm saying. So definitely, if you don't know how to slide cancel, definitely learn how to. Just and I'm not doing nothing. Just, just run. You know what I'm saying. And of course, I'm gonna I'm gonna try my best to um explain everything the best that I can. I'm also gonna be putting up clips for some of these um movement uh, tricks that I'm going to show you guys as well so yeah so that's the that's the uh, the importance of slide canceling if you don't know how to bunny hop it's pretty easy you just um while you're running you're gonna jump and aim but then as soon as you like feel your feet touch the ground you're gonna jump again so aim and then you'll just jump again Aim, jump again. Oh, aim, jump again. Run, aim, jump, jump. Jump, jump. And that's how you... That's how you bunny hop. Alright, another thing that we're going to get into that's really important, especially with this game. If you don't know, obviously, um, the tag sprint that they did to the, in, in this game like kind of ruined the movement the, or not the movement but the flu fluidity of um of the movement of the game which is called the tax sprint and if you don't know when the game first launched tax sprint was literally like broken you would slide cancel like twice 
and you wouldn't be able to tax sprint for like forever. But obviously since the patch they fixed it. So you see, I run out of tax sprint, but you you get it back somewhat quick, but it's still not quick enough. But I'm gonna show you guys on I'm gonna show you guys how to um how to reset it pretty much so you don't really get this animation as often. The way you tag reset in this game usually you can get like three or four slide cancels before you have to tag reset or you'll run out of tax sprint. But usually I like to do three slide cancels and then I'll either dolphin dive or I will um I'll I'll do a, a movement tip called snaking. But usually you could just dolphin dive and then you'll you'll get the the uh, the tax sprint back. So one, two, three. And you get it back right away. Just dolphin dive. One, two, three. See? And just get it right back. See how I ran out of tax sprint and I get it back. What you could do, you could just let your gun um you know you could just keep running, you'll get it back, but like if you just don't want to see that this jogging animation, just do that, dolphin dive, and you get it back. There's really no like importance of doing a YY or like spamming it, because I know a lot of people don't like it, but me personally, I do like it, and I've gotten really good at, at doing it, so, um, you know, I I like to do it just to make my, my clips look good, but you don't have to do it. This is just a, it's just a little uh, disclaimer that I wanted to put in the video, but um, yeah, we're gonna get uh, right into the next one. We got another really important um thing that I want to teach you guys, and it's it, it'll help a lot within Warzone multiplayer. It doesn't really matter what you play. It's called snaking, and um, it is a little bit difficult to do, but once you get the hang of it, it's really really helpful. And I, I advise you guys to do it. Um, so let's say for example, you have like a wall or a fence that's somewhat your same height level or maybe even like chest level. So this right here is, is literally perfect. So say there's an enemy right in front of me. So how, th this is, first of all, this is what, this is what it, it'll look like. This is, how, this is how you would snake. You could, you could left, right with it. I'm saying you could, and the reason why it works so really well is because while you're doing this right here, all they're seeing is you going like the top of your head going up and down. This is all they're seeing is your head going up and down. So let's say enemies right here, he's aiming at you. You guys are aiming at each other, right? You could just sneak, go all the way down, and like you could you could literally like just break his camera pretty much. Like at first I was here, you do that, you're here. You do that, you're here. You know what I'm saying? To do that, you're there. So, the way you would snake is you're going to prone all the way down, but while you're doing it, you're going to hold back on your stick and then pretty much run up, if that makes sense. Hold down on your stick, run up. Hold down, hold down with your right stick, pull down with your left stick, and then you're just going to run up. You see? And you just you just keep doing it. You just keep doing it. And then if you want to move with it, you just move your right stick to the side that you want. Obviously, want to move it on. You know what I'm saying? To the right, to the left, to the right, to the left. You know what I'm and that's how you snake. And if you're wondering how you want to get good aim on MW3, a really good way is to load up a private match and just load up a private match with bots, turn off your aim assist, and then just go to work. That's literally the best way you could do it, especially if you're on console. If you guys don't know, I'm on console as well. And this is what I do to improve my aim. Load up, load up some bots. Turn off your aim assist and just shoot a couple hundred bots. That's literally it. Not, don't do it on hardcore like how I am right now. I only did it just for the sake of, sake of the video. But turn up the health to maybe like 200, 250, 300. 
um, turn off your aim assist, and then just try your best to um, to kill them without the aim assist. And the more bots, the more bots you kill, the more um, the more used you'll get to it without aim assist. So then once you do turn it on, you're gonna see like a big difference. Cause you have nothing to, to guide your aim. So if you get good at not having nothing to guide your aim, and then you do put on aim assist, it's a literal aim bot. Plus the settings that I gave you guys at the at the beginning of the video too. You guys will have good aim in no time. Trust. Go to some bots. Just go to work. Honestly. And with that being said, that will conclude the movement guide. So I hope you guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I really um, enjoyed making this video for you guys. So just to do a quick recap, we went over slide canceling. We went over b hopping. I went over sneaking. I also went over tech re uh, reset, and I also taught you guys how to get good aim on um, on this game. So with just practice make sure you guys are in custom matches practicing on how to um you know how to really move like a like a demon for real. um and yeah with that being said i'm gonna throw in some extra clips right now so for you guys to watch and kind of like not analyze but you know just for you guys to watch and just enjoy so um yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you're new again subscribe like the video comment and i'll see you on the next one Lock in real quick for a little clear shit. Oh my god, that's a clip right here. Oh my god! I don't even give a fuck if I die.